Okay, here we have some hair dryer demos. And here on the left side, we have an old hair dryer. It's a good example from, this one was from, sent from our European colleagues, just to overemphasize how big and bulky they were. They're heavy, and they're also very noisy and very inefficient. Um, compared to the new ones, these are more, these are GAN-based designs here. Um, it's very challenging design to fit all the electronics inside together with the motor, uh, especially because this has to be very small form factor, lightweight, easy to hold and to maneuver. And so GAN has enabled um, these type of designs. I would imagine then in the future, they probably would want to cut the cord and make these more battery operated which would make it even more challenging for these designs and, and make the uh, available area to fit um, the electronics inside even smaller. So even a stronger need for GAN-based electronics inside and to go to higher frequencies and smaller components.